So guys, for the first method, make sure that the drive and the folder where you save your OBS recordings to has enough space. For the next method, once you're on OBS, you're going to click on help. Now you're going to click on check for updates. Make sure that your OBS is fully up to date. If you have an update that you need to do, you're going to click on update now. See if that works for you. Also, when you have OBS fully updated, you're going to go to help again and then click on check for file integrity. It's now going to verify and validate your OBS installation files. But your OBS must be fully up to date for it to check for you. For the next method, you're going to close out of OBS. Now you're going to search for it again, type in OBS. Now you want to run it as administrator. And then click on yes. See if that works for you. For the next method, make sure your graphics card drivers are fully up to date. For the last method, you're going to head over to search and type in add remove programs. Click on it. And then once you run this, we're going to scroll down until we find OBS. Here it is. Once you find OBS, you're going to click on the three dots and then click on uninstall. Then you want to uninstall OBS. And then once you uninstall OBS, you just want to install it again. There's going to be a link down below in the description to let you install it again. This should not fix your problem. 